trafficking in persons is a global problem. There are actually a lot of misconceptions out there about what trafficking is, and so it's really important to learn more about it, dig deeper, and really understand what trafficking looks like. Human trafficking is the exploitation of a person's labor through force, fraud, or coercion. And I think it's important to recognize that while this is a really specific definition, it's also a legal definition. And it exists with, uh, within a spectrum of a wide range of exploitation that's faced in a number of different ways through a number of different communities. People are trafficked for all kinds of reasons. They're trafficked to work on farms. They're trafficked to work in factories. Um, people are even trafficked into drug treatment programs where their very existence in those programs enables people to you know, collect prescriptions or Medicaid benefits. In my mind, trafficking is really defined by power and control and abuse of that power and control to either um, force someone to continue to engage in a specific type of work or to bring someone in and recruit someone into a particular type of work. LGBT clients are not often thought of when we talk about trafficking at all, but these are clients that are incredibly vulnerable because they face discrimination um, in the job context. Um, they may be pushed out of their homes because of their sexual orientation or their gender identity. The way that people are exploited is, is often determined by the ways that they're marginalized. Um, and so, you know, whether we're talking about youth uh, exchanging uh, sex on the street because they've been kicked out of their homes and they're searching for a homeless shelter, we're also talking about, you know, an undocumented person who might have come in on a visa and now has no way to get uh, formal employment and is relegated to working for two, three dollars an hour in the back of a restaurant. And so when we talk about trafficking, it's direly important to remember that the way that this happens breaks down in, in a variety of different ways and to not exclude people based on our own assumptions.